Okay, guys, so we're back. Um, <clears throat> I want you to get rid of everything in here. Um, leave the two quotation marks. Um, so we've got, yep, um, now I am percent D. Um, or actually, yeah, I am percent D old. Years old, actually, um, makes a bit more sense. Now, here we need another placeholder. Now, can we enter a string as say 150? Um, as you'll see, we can, but it's not the correct string. It's basic, that's basically saying that there was an error, and the error was because we're entering a string when it's expecting a digit. Now, for a digit. We need no, like we need an integer for a digit. So 150, no decimals, no letters, and then we can build and run it. Now, there we go, I'm 150 years old. I am not that old, but I'm getting there. Um, and now, what we're gonna do is, I'm um, just gonna do a little print F. Um, now, I am pi and my number oh, number is now here we want percent percent f because it's a float. A float allows for decimal places. Now just uh, put another comma here and we're gonna do three point one four one five nine Two six five long. It's very long. Um, now we're going to run this, and what we'll see is it cuts off after the nine. Well, technically after the nine, it cuts off uh, right here because we've got a two that's been rounded up from sixty five. So if this was down to four, and we where to rebuild the program, we'll get 9.2 because it's less than 5. So just basic maths, um, some of you guys would have experienced that in, uh, by now in school, hoping most of you actually. Um, <clears throat> but what we can do here is um, we'll just copy this one out again, and we can select the number of decimal places we want it to by putting a dot, then in this case, four. Now six is the initial decimal places. Um, I, sorry, that was my bad. Um, I knew, made a bit of a mistake. Um, it was all on one line, so it was a bit of a jumbled mess. Now, as you can see here, is I'm 150 years old. I forgot another line. New um, and then there's the default value which goes to six decimal places and this is the one that we've modified to only four. Again it's rounded up to six but what we remember was that this, uh, oh, sorry, that this four is actually a six and we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So if we put in eight here wait, it will show it to the end of it, well, to the end of eight decimal places. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now, that's it for now. Uh, when we get back, I believe we're up to variables. I've got a little plan that I just can't remember what I'm up to, and I'll see you guys later.